And the State Board of Education set to meet this morning just a day after the state superintendent responded to recently announced expansions to Title IX protections. Yeah, race and gender and also questions about leadership after members of the board resigned. KOCO's Cameron Seibert live this morning as we get closer to that meeting here a little later. And Cameron, what's on the agenda for today? Yeah, good morning. Another packed agenda, another busy time for the State Board of Education with a lot of concern for Oklahomans at the time of this meeting. There are some of the folks that are going to plan to speak during public comment today. Along with the usual agenda points like accreditation statuses and teacher applications, we could hear some public comments today critical of Superintendent Ryan Walters. Some Oklahomans right now say they want answers about an increase in resignations and also alleged mismanagement of funds from top officials. Just yesterday here on KOCO, we spoke one on one with Superintendent Walters about a new Title IX rule for President Biden regarding transgender students. Walters says Oklahoma plans to not comply. We have sent him a letter. We have sent the secretary a letter saying we will not comply with this. We have sent all the schools a letter telling the schools not to comply with this. In the meantime, Walters has proposed a rule to ban diversity, equity and inclusion programs in this state. Also a rule that would better track teachers accused of abuse in the classroom. So today's meeting starts at 930. A lot of controversial issues on the minds of Oklahomans and the folks here that are hoping to get their chance to speak during public comment. Live in Oklahoma City this morning, Cameron Seibert, KOCO 5 News.